Hello, this is a quick review of the Gannett Export Electromechanical Payload Release for the DJI Mavic Pro 2. So, this drone, this is the device. Um, I paid $169 for the device and then $20 for shipping from dronefishing.com. Uh, they're located in, I think, South Africa and they shipped to Palmer, Alaska. The reason I went with this device was because of its mechanical release capabilities. If a bird hit the line or my bail closed or any other issue that caused the line to get caught, it would be less likely to cause the drone to crash. Instead, the mechanism would release and the drone would continue to stay airborne. I was using the device for surf fishing for halibut. Uh, the approximate weight it was carrying was a total of 12 ounces. Uh, 8 ounces for the lead, uh, 10, a 10-aught 10 hook, and then a couple swivels, and then the bait. Um, one of the first difficulties I had was that the device didn't come with the rubber band to attach it to the drone. Fortunately, I had some pretty heavy-duty rubber bands from a Garmin Cadence sensor. Uh, so that's this here. I put two of them together to get the length right. Uh, and basically the, the device goes over, you got your bottom uh, lights here and there's a sensor on the uh, device that goes right over one of those lights and then um, you attach it like like so, and then uh, basically you want the rubber band to be strong enough to hold the, uh, the device up against those lights with your payload. Um, so it can't just be a normal rubber band. The other issue I had was that the uh, ambient light was causing the device to release prematurely. So basically light was getting between the sensor and the drone's light and it would release it. Uh, it's supposed to be, it's supposed to automatically adjust for that. Uh, it did not, that part of the system didn't seem to work. So what I did was uh, tried to block out all ambient light by putting, I covered up the wires with electrical tape, which I'm not sure was necessary, but I did it anyways. And then, uh, covered up the sensor with a piece of foam, which actually there were two of them that came with the device. I'm not sure if it was, not sure what, what they were planning for using for that, but this is what I used it for. Um, I cut the foam so it was about as half as thick and then uh, punched a hole in it with a, a weight slide here so that the hole is about that size. So just enough to, just enough for the sensor to poke through or to see through it. Um, once I got that part of the system to work properly, I um, took the took it out for a test run, and the first cast was about 100 yards before it uh, released uh, manually or mechanically, not not with me hitting the button. Uh, I figured it was because I had the tension set too low, so you adjust the tension with the Allen wrench. I believe the Allen wrench came with the device, so uh, basically clockwise increases the tension, counterclockwise decreases the tension, depending on how much weight you're wanting to pull or what kind of safety margin you want. Um, after a few casts, I think the furthest I got was about 400 feet before it would release. Uh, most of that issue, I never did release it with the button, it was always doing it mechanically. Um, because of the uh, drag from the line, basically, it was causing enough tension to, to pull it loose. Um, I also never, like, really cranked on it. I just maybe did a, a full turn past what it would, uh, past my initial setting, so I needed to do probably two or three turns. Uh, I think the way to do it would be to decide what you want your safety margin to be. So I was thinking maybe a pound, so have a pound hanging underneath it and 
adjust the tension until it just releases that one that one pound um, and then that's just as far as the as far as the drone will take it basically before it releases or you or you hit the button because you want to release it sooner um, other than that I'm pretty happy with the device uh, and if you guys have any other questions uh, just leave them in the comments and I'll get hopefully be able to answer them as soon as possible thank you